Hi, sixth graders. It's Mrs. Shanahan down here in the counseling office. I'm one of the counselors. I have some exciting news to share with you guys. We are starting to look at for next year, and we are going to be getting your seventh grade enrollment card in your math classes in the next couple of days. But I want to go over it with you. So as you're looking at it, your enrollment card is going to be due March 24th to your math teacher. You will have your name, your student ID, and your math teacher on here. You have some required core classes. You have language arts, social studies, math, and science. And then you also, we try to have the required exploratory class of gym. Now, this does look similar to your sixth grade card, but you're going to have a different task. So you can continue with band, and if that's the option you wanna choose, you're gonna mark one. But this is the different part. You're gonna circle two exploratory classes on the back, the two that you want. You also need to circle the instrument that you play. With orchestra, let's say you're in orchestra and you're gonna continue that next year, you're gonna mark this box. You, again, are going to circle two exploratory classes on the back. Uh, you need to circle what enroll what instrument you are going to need to play option three is choir we are going to try to have choir next year if we have enough kids sign up so you're going to mark that and you're going to circle two exploratory classes on the back for option four let's say music is just not your thing that's fine you're going to mark that box option four and you're going to circle four exploratory classes on the back now when, you re when you're when you done, what you need to do is, it's your responsibility to provide for an instrument if you're doing the instruments. This is for band and orchestra, our year-long classes, so is choir. And it's important that you participate in all the concerts. So this is a statement that you're agreeing to. You're going to sign here, and your parent is going to sign this enrollment card. So when you turn it in, it needs to have both signatures. Now, on the back is all the elective classes that are going to be offered. These are the ones that you are going to be circling. You do not need to circle band or orchestra or choir because that's done on the front, but everything else is on the back. That is where you will circle. It should be really easy to do. You just are going to turn it in to your math teacher once you have it filled out. And like I said before, it is due March 24th. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out. Thanks.